Huh? I'm back in Traverse Town. Why, hello down there, Sora. I've been waiting. You do know you can wait on the ground, right? Come down so we can talk. Now? Now? What do you mean, now? You're the one who said you were waiting. You know, you're turning more into Neku every day. But listen, I'm glad you two showed up you because... You two? Does that mean Riku's here? Yes, but you and he are still a world apart. He didn't seem especially worried, though. He knows he'll find you. Yeah. Just look at Neku. He and the others all found their game partners. Oh, they're back home safe now? Mm. Remember what I told you. Their existence is on the line. And the Reapers are dead set on erasing them for good. But they found refuge in this world. And luckily, each other too. Reapers? Right. If Neku and the others want to get back to where they came from, they need to win the Reaper's game. It's like a series of missions. Those are the rules of their home ground. Except, this time, the mission is a tough one. They're pitted against a Dream Eater that can summon a hundred more like it. So, I was sort of hoping you and Riku could help us out. You have your Keyblades, and with those, we might still have a chance. Well, I'm glad he's here with me. If he is. Riku's on one side of the portal, and you're on the other. He might be by your side, he might be a million miles away. You can't measure the distance in time or space. Even without the wall between you, it's hard to say. Don't worry. He's with me. Even when it might seem like he's not. <laughs> then you two are lucky. You and your friend are lucky too, Joshua. I appreciate you saying that with conviction, even though you have no idea what you're talking about. Hey! Anyway, Neku and his partner are pinned down in the Fountain Plaza. I can count on you, right? Always! <sighs> this is starting to wear me down. Can we get a time out? What? <laughs> Miss me? Ugh. Sora? I'll take it from here. No. I don't need your help. Of course you do. Where are your dream eaters? How else can you fight? I don't need them anymore. Oh, right. Your partner. Well, don't you want to make it out of the game? Who's going to help her if you get hurt? Okay, you win. I'll let you do the sweating. He got away! Sora. So, you must be Neku's partner. Yeah. I'm Shiki. Nice to meet you. Neku told me all about you. Cool. But you should have seen him. He looked everywhere for you. Hey, Sora, stop talking. What? Why? You said you need her. That's a good thing. Uh. That's sweet, Neku. I need you to stop annoying me. Mm -hmm. Well, I still think it's sweet. It's nice to be needed. I'm sorry, is this a bad time? Because that Dream Eater we're after has retreated to the other imagining of this world. Other imagining? You mean... where Riku is? Yes. He and our other friends will do what they can, but we'll just run ourselves in circles at this rate. We need to trap that thing in one place, and then we can finish it. Trap it where? The third district. Okay. <laughs> hmm? Joshua. Yes, Neku? Tell me. Are we really gonna make it home? But Neku, I thought you couldn't afford to lose. Give up on yourself, and you give up on the world. Right. So I'll see you there? Huh? Uh, 
me? Yeah. You're my friend. It's your home, too. <laughs> Maybe it's you that's turning into Sora. Huh? Thanks. Traverse Town? Why am I back? Hmm? Joshua. Nice of you to join us. What happened? Trouble happened. I was hoping one of you could help. When did Sora get here? Bravo, Riku. Why can't he be this quick on the uptake? Yeah, well, Sora's a little... <laughs> <laughs> now, let's get down to the problem. We've got a nasty Dream Eater on our hands. It keeps jumping between worlds. Not only that, it knows how to summon creatures like it. Pretty powerful ones, too. The others are on a mission to stop it, but they need help. The others? You mean Shiki and her friends? That's right. They all found their game partners, and Shiki is over fighting in the other Traverse Town. In fact, Sora is helping them out. Good to hear. So what can I do? Actually, the Dream Eater just reappeared in the Fountain Plaza. I sent Bede and his partner to face it. I'm on it. Riku, there's something else you need to know. Hmm? These two Traverse Towns separated by the portal. I was under the impression they were parallel worlds, but it looks like I was wrong. Wrong how? That's where it gets tricky. After you and Sora left, Shiki crossed the portal to join her game partner. Did you notice players have a mission timer inscribed on their hands? Well, when she got to the other side, Shiki had more time left on her clock than her partner. And when Beat's partner crossed over from the other side, she had less time left. So time flows differently here and there? So what? That's true of any two worlds. Their homeworld would be running on a different time axis, too. Yes, I understand that. But if these Traverse Towns were parallel worlds, then time would flow the same in both. But it doesn't. Ergo, they are not parallel worlds. You mean there's a past and a future? No. Impossible. The worlds are clearly separate. It's not just time that sets them apart. As you yourself noted, every world flows at its own pace. Which tells me that for all their similarities, these are two distinct worlds. Distinct worlds? Yes. But this is all conjecture. It's like the same world imagined by two people. What does that tell you? That we're in... The dream. Yes. Bravo again, Riku. In which case, none of this may matter one bit to me or my friends. But to you and Sora, I think it might be a vital clue. Right. Thanks. Beat! About time, yo! Beat! What happened to your Dream Eaters? Don't need them when I've got my game partner. And I don't need you! Ah, oh, here we go again. Five seconds ago it was, where's Riku? And now the act? Whoa! Don't tell him that. <laughs> it's so nice to meet you. I'm Rhyme. Riku, right? Sorry my partner's acting like a doofus. I am not! You always gotta go around and, and garnish my reputation! Since when? You burned that bridge all by yourself. Nobody raises his reputation by lowering others. <laughs> Yo, Riku, you gonna sit there and let her get in my grill? Sorry, it's just... You two are cut from the same cloth. I ain't I know. made of cloth. <laughs> Beat looks and talks like a punk, but there's a heart of gold in there somewhere. Yeah, he's come through for me, so I know what you mean. There, see, I'm a... Rhyme? You didn't just call me a punk again. Huh? 
<laughs> All right, now we ruffled its feathers. Ready to do this? Yeah! Me and Ryan will handle things here. You go after that thing. Right. <laughs> I got you now. This is my street, yo. You gotta play by the rules. Oh, no! Hey! Sora, you got this. This is so tired, yo. Every time we chase him down. I know. But we've got an ally on the other side. Don't worry. Yeah, well, I still don't like it. You know, you are such a good listener, Beat. You're like a sponge, really. Me? I'm not a sponge. I'm just me. <laughs> you mean Daisuke Nojo Beto. Hey! Don't use my full name! That's a weird name. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> Well, it's time to go. Hey, Riku. Thanks. Yeah, stay cool. We'll catch up with you soon. Mm-hmm. Say hi to Sora. Sure. Riku, remember what I say. Be careful. If this really is a dream, it's going to lie to you to try and make you think it's real. I got it. What? I don't got it. You and Sora would break your heads on this one. What? Got it, Riku. It's working. People through for us. We'll handle things here. You take care of the boss. We'll do. Ah, uh, not again. Hey, Josh. Where'd it go? Somewhere else. Out of Traverse Town, and out of my reach. We'll just have to let it go. Great. So we failed the mission? Hmm. I'll go after it. What? Come on, I'm not an actual player. Can't I bend the rules? <laughs> <laughs> well, I guess the rules of the world don't apply if your hearts are connected. Right, Sora? That's how you roll. Right. Then it's settled. Sora. Hmm? Thanks. It wasn't easy. You made it easier. Yeah. Wow, Neku. You've changed. Huh? You think? You're less dorky. What? <laughs> Once you find your friend, Sora, you should come hang out in our town. Definitely. See you in Shibuya. Sure. It's a deal. <sighs> Anything I should pass on to Riku? Nah. I'll see him soon. <laughs> <laughs> Thug works for me. We all got a role to play, right? Gorsh, at least he's honest in a dishonest way. Silence! No underling of mine shall be insulted so. Mm. I have great plans for dear Pete and for all the worlds. 
once I have taken them for my own. Then I've got bad news for you. That day's never gonna come. <laughs> Perhaps you should take a few moments to reconsider. Or does the Queen's life mean nothing to you at all? Mickey! Don't you listen to her! You can't let Maleficent have her word! No! Mommy! All right, Maleficent. Tell us what you want. Let me see. Shall I begin with this world? I much preferred it in its darker, more ominous permutation. You said it! This place needs some lights out time! You're lying, Maleficent. Not even you would go through this much trouble just for that. What is it you're really after? <sighs> Very perceptive. I presume you are familiar with Xehanort? The man who led me to discover worlds outside of my own. You know him? As do you, I see. Yes, he shared everything with me. How to go about winning a heart over to the darkness. And, most gloriously, about the seven hearts of pure light. The ones that would grant me the power I need to conquer all worlds. However, the worlds were too complex, too much for even me to contain. It seemed I had miscalculated. Then it came to me. Of course, I could go about conquering other worlds in my own manner. You do have the data for all the worlds, do you not? Me. And now you will hand it over to me. What do you mean? Don't you bozos pretend you don't remember? Me and Maleficent was trapped inside it. Now cough it up! Why do you want the data? I'm afraid that is no concern of yours. Uh, uh, uh. Wouldn't want a royal Minnie Mouse in us to get a boo boo now, would we? I see you have failed to recognize the futility of your situation. Very well. Face your doom! Wow. Oh. Uh -huh. <gasps> uh, oh, oh, Mickey! Minnie! <laughs> Maleficent, you lose! <sighs> Say, uh, milady, I think the pipsqueak's right. We better hit the road. I now know that what I seek lies within these walls. Trust that I will eliminate you in good time. Hey, wait for me, Maleficent. Wait! Hmm? You used the darkness to get here? That was reckless. But gosh, I didn't expect you to save us. Axel. Axel didn't. My name is Lee. Got it memorized? <laughs>